Welcome back to Harry Potthead. The last time we were here, we were delivering a bit of goil to a crying ghost's bathroom. Yeah. Because there's nothing wrong with that sentence. Oh, yeah. Because we didn't do this the last time, let's see what we got. Remember the guy f that fought for goblins' rights? Yep, which who invented the flu powder from the first game. Circle an ancient Greek lived on Iceland island of Iaria. Iaia. Uh, okay. If anyone will pronounce A E A E A I will friggin' clap for you. Expert at turning lost sailors into Pigs. Okay. That's good for a farm, I guess. Okay, we know you. We know all of them. Remember you, I remember you, and you are Miranda Goshav, 1921 present. Yeah, I know you. Know you. We know a river troll. Friggin' know you all. Hmm. Balfour Plain, 1566-1629. Established the Committee on Experimental Charms. They would experiment charms on each other. That's why he friggin' has a waist that looks wrong. Rodvik Plumpton. Yeah, I remember you from the first game. Patrick Bloxham, 1794-1810, author of the Toadstool Tales, a series of children's books since banned because they have been found to cause nausea and vomiting. Huh. Wonder what the hell you were writing in them. <laughs> yeah, it's like, and then out of the toad, green bus started to come out. You know. Then the young how Johnny slit his wrists and saw the insides of himself. And there were green and blue and yellow and that's how they looked and then the child starts vomiting. Okay, remember you from the first game as well. It's like there's lots of characters from the first game, so it seems. And we're going to go back into the girl's bathroom to peek around the ghost. With a bit of Goil and ourselves. No matter how wrong all of that sounds. And seriously. Goil of all people as well. Whee! Whee! I've got the bit of Goil. Well done, mate! I got a bit of Goil! Well done! Look! That was his nose! There you go. Rather you than me. Thanks. <laughs> Cheers, Harry. Ugh. Harry! <laughs> that was tasty, wasn't it? Ugh. That is disgusting! <laughs> Not as much as those ladies' books, so it seems, because they cause nausea and vomiting. <laughs> Yay! Are you okay? Uh, Harry? Even my coat transformed! Down to the dungeons and see if you can get into the common room. Okay. <laughs> We're the redone in one now. Hello? Okay, I will. Soon. Hello, Hamura. <laughs> but yeah, in any ways, I want to check out all of the secrets huh? right before doing huh? that. Huh? 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 Yeah. Huh? Friggin' Goyle. This is a girl's bathroom. You don't say. You sure it's not a boy's? You sure it was? Okay, I doubt we are good at jumping with the friggin' Goyle. Miserable moaning. 
burning, moping myrtle. Why are you so miserable? I do have feelings, you know, even if I am dead. That's great! Peeves upset me so much, I came in here and tried to kill myself. But then I remembered that... that I'm already <gasps> dead! In Soviet <gasps> Russia. <gasps> yup, there's nothing in there. Good for us. But <laughs> yeah, it's like Peev upsets me too. Never tried to kill because of him. Tried to kill. Never tried to suicide because of him. That would be stupid. I just love that idiotic voice. Hello, Hamura. See? <laughs> He's funny. <laughs> He's kind of retarded and slow as well. Yay! Loading is still with Harry, even though I'm not him now. Oh, I am sort of Harry. Hello! What's where you're going? If there's been another attack, I want to go home. That's great. Excuse me. No. Pardon me. No. What's where you're going? Well, at least we didn't broke her lines, and she didn't say anything specific to Harry. Pardon me. I'm just wondering, can I enter the main room as him? It'd be stupid if I could. No, I can't. That's good. It's like, hello, Slithering, want to enter? Sure. You know. Kind of not good for the game. <laughs> Defendo. Uh. 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 Aw, poor heavy, heavy, heavy person. Hello. Sorry, I've run out of stock. You'll have to come back later. I'm just making sure that he always, you know, acts exactly the same. Sorry, no time to chat. You have a very mature voice, you know. <laughs> but in any ways, yeah, I'm just making sure that they act exactly the same with everyone. It's like equal rights, you know. Ooh! Ceiling. Also has a, has a less of a rendered face than Harry. But still. Yay! Pure blood. What's the password? The tribe moves up to the dream to the slithering common room. No shit, Harry. Harry likes to speak to himself. No matter who. Yay! 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 Yay for that sound! Pure blood. I'm a pure friggin' Harry's blood as well. Okay, now this is stupid. It growls at you as well. Now, do notice that when you enter a Gryffindor room, you enter it straight away. When you try to enter the Slithering room, you have a friggin' obstacle course. It's like, I pity Slytherin. It's like, why were you late today? Well... I was spending an hour getting into my room. It's like, I was spending an hour getting out of it as well. 
just for the sakes of beings that we don't need. Oh, come on, you little swine. Fair enough. Leaving you alone now. You turn around, you stare at me. You all turn your backs to me. Yay. Are we even heading to the right direction? I wouldn't be surprised if we're not. <laughs> we are, but it's friggin' confusing. Have fun, Goyle. <laughs> I am not Coil. I'm Dev No. Yay! Secret area for the win. Also, do have in mind that there's always an emergency platforming in here. It's like, just in case that happened, let's leave some platforms in here. Just in case the chest gets trapped, let's leave some pushable in blocks in here. So, I mean, seriously, who designed this castle? Did something wrong? <laughs> 